Hi guys, it's Simone Thomas. I'm here with Mr. Karamo, Mr. Bobby Burke. What made you guys want to come out to support the 50th anniversary of the Los Angeles LGBT Center? So we're going to be talking about this on stage. So I used to work at this center. I used to work directly with homeless youth for many, many years. And I saw how many kids who felt alone, who felt like they couldn't, they couldn't live, there was, their lives weren't important, came here and got support just by being surrounded by community and also all the services the center gives. So now that I've made it, I want to continue that support by giving back. You know, and for me, I was one of those queer homeless youth, you know, that didn't have a support center like this, that didn't have a, this pe the people around to love him for who he was. And so for me, it's important just to give the center even more visibility so it can continue to grow, can continue to thrive, and just keep helping people. Yeah. Paying it forward for the people who need that help, especially people like you who didn't have those resources. Completely, yes. Is there anybody that you guys are really excited to see tonight? Because Sia is performing, uh, oh different gosh. presenters. I love with Sia. Sia is amazing. Haley Cuoco is a friend of mine. I can't wait to see her. Um, Valentina. Um, we just saw um, Jane Fonda backstage. Lily, Lily Tomlin. Tomlin. I'm yeah, I know. Them. They're exciting. So Such good people. By the way, congrats on Dancing with the Stars. Thank you. How excited are you to see him, support him? Are you going to like go to the show? Hell yeah, he's yes, coming. Yes, what yeah. week? What week? Not next week, no, the week we'll, after. Yeah, we'll uh, get my favorite is the, the premiere that he was literally the dancing emoji <laughs> in the purple suit. <laughs> I was Look on your phone, I at was, the dancing, it's literally, it's Karamo. I was, I was. I, was, <laughs> I like it, I like it. Was, yeah. And then this past week you were dancing salsa yes. to Lizzo's uh, juice. How was that, learning the moves? It is crazy, because the only dance moves I know are Beyonce dance moves, so. Patch your week. Yeah, Pat, I know. <laughs> I mean, single ladies. So the fact that I'm literally here learning other moves that I've never done is crazy. Have so. you been able to master anything like pure yeah, well, you know, I, got, I got rhythm, so that was the easy part for me. And so it's just like finding the time to really just like concentrate and get it going. It'll, you'll get there with time and practice. Yeah, you'll be really a pro. Will. We've seen him dance. Yes, he beat me at lip sync battle. Exactly. So it's good. <laughs> good luck with it. And then the very last question is: What three shows are you guys both watching, and why should everyone be watching them? Ooh, three shows. Um, I don't know what shows. We're so busy nowadays. We don't, we don't watch a lot of TV oh gosh, these days. Yeah. Uh, I feel like Tales that's of the city. Tales of the city on Netflix is really, really great. It's a great queer story. No, I'm gonna give you a little bit of t um, tidbit. So when I was working at the center, I decided I wanted to become a television host. And one of the places that I first went was to Maria Menounos and Afterbus TV. And I told myself if I got the training here, that I would be able to become the star that I want to be. And you're getting that training right here, so just know your dream's about to blow up. Just trust and believe in it, okay? I'm like, no, I'm seriously getting yeah. emotional. Yeah. That made me so... It's coming. Feel it's so coming. special. Thank it's you. Coming. You're a sweetheart. It's Thank you. you. I, Maria's amazing. Afterbuzz is amazing. Yeah. Thank you guys. Thank yes, you. But you're also an amazing host. So oh, keep, thank yeah, you. Thank uh, you so much. Yeah. <laughs> Bye.